Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as many of you know, back in the day, Microsoft rolled out Windows 7. And then after Windows 7, they rolled out Windows 8, 8.1, skipped Windows 9 completely. So there was no version of Windows 9 and went to Windows 10. And now we have Windows 11. Now, there are still references to Windows 9, believe it or not, that can still be found in the Windows 11 operating system, which gives us a clear indication that Microsoft was working on Windows 9 behind the scenes. And in Windows 11, if you'd like to go see the, these little references to Windows 9, it's quite simple. And to do this, we just head to our C drive, double click on that. Then you head to your Windows folder, double click on that. And then you just go to System32, and then you look for a folder called MigWiz, which is short for Migration Wizard. We just double click on that. And then we go to a folder in MigWiz called Replacement Manifests. And this is a folder basically which is just a record of all the work that Microsoft has been doing and has been going on behind the scenes. And then you look for a little file here called Command Prompt. Win8 replacement and to open it we just right click on it open with notepad and here we have two references to Windows 9 the first is gather blocks required for collecting data from Windows 8 Windows Blue which was a code name for Windows 8.1 and some Windows 9 systems and then the next reference says apply blocks required for applying to Windows 9 versions built before the correct command prompt dot man reaches win main. So yeah, we have two references as mentioned, the first Windows 9 and then the second Windows 9. Now, there are a couple of theories why Microsoft never released Windows 9. And the first is that they wanted the next operating system to stand out as much as possible from Windows 8 for marketing reasons and basically that's why they jumped from straight from Windows 8 skip version uh, Windows version 9 and went straight to Windows 10 and then another theory is that um, Windows 9 could have been interpreted by some software and programs as 95 and Windows 98 so the 9 could have caused problems where some software could have interpreted that as Windows 95 and 98 and which could, could have possibly caused a whole lot of problems for Microsoft. And that's why they skipped Windows 9 completely and jumped straight to Windows 10. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.